Yeah, I think it packed. I mean, the event is so strong that... Um, he'll probably play E4, right? So, let's play a Moran. I was going to play the old G3 line. Um, I'm just going to play something that's a little bit dubious, but probably playable. It's obviously a little bit dubious what I played, but I just don't want to get into some heavy theory with this guy, because this guy's another one of the pupils of uh, Peter Peter Leko, so he's very theoretically heavy in his knowledge. Yeah, Queen D3 makes sense. I mean, I can go C5. I can also take and play like B5, maybe. Honestly, I don't know, so I'm going to do it. Why not? Go B5. I'm going to go like A6, C5, C4. I don't know if this is actually good. It's probably not good, but at this point, I don't care. You can go either way. I don't know which one he'll do. They're both playable. Let's go here and c5, of course. He could play knight e5, I suppose, but I can just go like queen c8 and c5 anyway. I go there. If I go queen c8, what's his move? I don't really want to trade and go knight d7. That feels kind of wrong. But is it wrong? Probably it is wrong. So if I perceive it to be wrong, then I'll just go queen c8. Queen b6 and c5 is maybe playable too. But I think queen b6 are some bishop e3 line that I lost to against Magnus as well. So don't want to go into any of that. Okay, so he goes there. So if I play c5... Oh, it doesn't work. So he's got d5. d5. Hmm, this feels kind of wrong. Um... Of course, I've misplayed this. I'm just actually much worse here. I'm going to take and go for this, which is not what I wanted to do at all. But I can go C5, C4, maybe. I don't really like this position, but time is still even. If I get C5, which of course I'm going to play here, I'm not going to take the pawn. It's insane. Knight D6, I just take... Bishop g5, I go h6. Okay, logical. Now, I could take the knight here. I can also go c4. I can also go bishop d5, but I think I should just go here. If knight d6, I just take. Is he have bishop g5 now, maybe? Maybe, maybe not. Who cares? Can I take? Okay, of course I have to take. I can castle. I can also go c4. I think I should just castle and play c4 and work a7, probably. Maybe it's not so. Eh. Am I actually just losing here? Wait, no, I have c4 and queen a7. c4. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to play C4. I, I actually think I'm in a lot of trouble here. I think I'm in real trouble again because my openings are just... These dubious openings against these top guys just are not working out the way that I'd like them to. If I can get a pass pawn, maybe I'm okay. It goes h4, logical move. Um, he's trying to play this. I mean, h6 makes sense. Kind of. Also kind of not. Let's just go here. I think h6 is playable. Queen g4, I just slide the king up. I mean, you can always sack, but I think I'm okay. I've got to go like rookie 8. And... This looks very, very ugly. But I think I'm kind of holding for the time being. If I get b4, c3, c2, I'm actually getting counterplay. What does that do? I know what it does, but I'm just going to go b4, c3. So I have to get counterplay. Otherwise, I'm just going to get massacred on the king side here eventually. Okay, I mean, I have knight c5. It's also f5. No, f5 is wrong. 
go c3, c2, this is nothing. If I go a5, uh, a5 is going to go queen d4, I guess. b3, b2. b3 takes, takes, takes c2, rook c7, d c1. Let's go here. I think this is working. He's spending too much time, actually. Wait, what is he doing? Huh? I'll take it, but... Yeah, I'm just winning now. Okay, good. Let's go. He's gonna try to sack, of course. It's Salem. He, he likes to sack. The key here is to not mess it up. So let's just go here, I guess. Pressure the pawns. Let's go here. I want to go rook d1. Very strange blunder from Slum. Takes. Yeah, I mean. Strange, strange.